Hello, welcome everyone. After a long break, because um, I didn't make any move on the video because it was extremely busy here, you know. But um, what, I, what I want to say, I, I say, I want to say that thank you very much for 2,000 su subscribers I have now. So I'm very happy. I never, I never thought there would be that many subscribers, you know, that many people in interesting about this. So I'm very happy and I decided when I have 2,000 subscribers and do another couple of videos, you know, so. Okay, today we have uh, that TV, we work on the Samsung TV, the Secure TV, model number UE49KU60, sorry, 6100K, okay? So that's a smart TV, 4K TV, curved. And what's happened? Um, Let's plug it in, okay? So let's plug it in. You can see, I turned on this TV. I don't know if you can see the uh, standby light. So the standby light is here. I uh, don't know if you can see. Right, the standby light is here. And it's, uh, it's trying to turn on. The backlight is for a split second and then it goes back off, you see? Turn on and off all the time. Okay? Blinking a couple of times then. We know the backlight is, um, is it's turning on for a few seconds. Okay, I show you, show you what's going on. Uh, I want to be honest with you, I opened this TV before and I thought, okay, that would be interesting. So, that would be easier to open. Where is my Samsung opening tool? It's here. Okay. Now, okay, so we have cover it off. Now, okay, so what, what you can see here, power supply, motherboard, two ribbon cables go to the screen. Okay, how to check? How to check what's going on here? What is broken? First thing, we check if the power supply and backlight is okay. So we disconnect the, the cable, which is connecting the power supply and motherboard. So now we have only the power supply section working and we plug it in and you can see the backlight is on okay and um, so we know the backlight is okay and we check the power supply if we have all voltages um, I don't know if you can see but the all voltage is probably working uh, as you can see here we have a 12 volts here Just make it short. And we have a 12 volt and 5 volts okay here. So we know the power supply is working fine. No issue. And power supply is fine, backlight is fine. So problem could be the motherboard or screen itself. But from experience I know the problem is with the with the screen. As always. It's never the motherboard. Never. Um, it's not working like that because in the some uh, Samsung TVs you can just disconnect one, disconnect the screen, and uh, the television should turn on. But it's not not here. This model need to be connected to the screen. I turn on. I, have, I see the. Yeah, it's not turning on at all because it's uh, not connect. Oh yeah, we have a backlight and this goes off. You see? Turning on. We see the backlight, the second and then this goes off. So we know, we know the problem is with the screen. Screen itself, how to fix it? It's very easy to fix it. Very easy. 
but you need to be very very careful and passion you know so we take uh, the piece of the tape the it's a captain tape okay try to put it on sale in my shop and we try to cover a couple of pins and we see what we have I cover a couple of pins and we see if we have any different now okay turn on I show you we have a picture on now something or nothing some picture yeah we have a picture but as you can see we have a lines we have a lot of lines here and and the colors on the side is not so good so basically what you need to do you need to find where is the good position of this tape and uh, what size of this tape should be okay so Okay, basically, I show you now, because I, I checked this before, which position is good. And how many pins you should cover. Okay, I, I prepared this before because I, I spent about half an hour to find where the good, pla good places, which position it should be. That position here. You see? We still have a line, so no, not we have to move this a little bit. One way or another. But I know where is where this should be plus minus, you know. No, that's the set. So we move a little bit another way. Move this top. Maybe try to wider tape. In this TV is very difficult to find the right place, you know. Yeah, that's a good position now. As you can see, the, there is no lines. Picture is perfect. Yeah, no issues. Okay, so I show you now exactly where where the tape should be, what size tape, and that's all. Okay, I show you now. I take the camera. I turn off this camera. So that's the that's the tape where I where I put this tape to cover a couple of pins there. Um, as you can see, okay, it's a bottom bottom ribbon cable and as you can see i don't know how many pins but it's about 10 pins let me check this one second okay yeah, we have it here uh let's count it one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and another 10 is covered okay so i mark this maybe Mark this maybe with um, some kind of I have a marker here, so we mark this to be sure where it is. It's about here. Okay. 
I just mark this for myself, you know, and make a photo. And I store this in in my library, you know, uh, because um, it was very difficult to find the right points, you know. There always was some lines, so couple lines. Uh, but this is the best. This is the best. And the best position I put it back in this here. Okay, and we turn on TV again, and we'll see how the picture is look like. Okay, so oh, um, oh, it's very. One second. It's very. Yeah. So. Okay, and there's no lines here. Yeah, the picture is perfect. So no issues. Okay, as you can see, this this is the same TV yeah, with this with this tape here. Okay. Okay. So I put everything together now, and um, hopefully it will be working for some time. You know, but. Uh, it's, it's a shame, you know, to... I don't know why this happened. Spent a lot of money for this TV and then this happened. Okay, so I put everything together and I send this back to customer. Thank you for watching and see you next time.